Welcome back, everybody. We are doing more single battles, so hopefully we can pull out some more wins. All right, there. Get the team, and let's go. Can we find people relatively fast is the question. All right, the answer is yes. We found one that I cannot pronounce. Oh, that's got to be an Eviolite. Let's see. Hmm. Scissor doesn't want to go up against that Charizard or that Machamp. So, in terms of Saramosa, let's see. It's water flying, so Gyarados goes first. I've got poison. Let's go Dragonite first. Oh, you know what? Yeah, let's go with Dragonite. And there's nothing that Konfei is actually weak to on that team. So let's go with Dragonite, Konfei, and let's go with Tapu Lele. Let's go with that. Alright, so what is the first matchup going to be? People really like that Explorer's outfit. So the first matchup is going to be Charizard. Good thing I didn't send out Scizor. Okay, let's go ahead and do a Dragon Dance. Okay, well, I get a free Dragon Dance, thanks to that. And he's sitting out Kangaskhan. Kangaskhan probably has Ice Punch. So what I'll do is I will Dragon Claw it. Oh, it was a critical hit. I was wondering what was going on. Focus energy? Uh-huh. Well, I'm just going to do an extreme speed in case you've got priority or something. Alright. That's one down. We already know he's got a Charizard, so what's his next Pokemon? His next Pokemon is Alakazam. Okay. Alakazam is a very frail Pokemon, so I'll just do an extreme speed. And one shot it. Alright. Now he's got one last Pokemon, which is Charizard. So the question is what's Charizard going to do that can screw Dragonite over? don't know of much, but I'll throw out a Thunder Punch. Okay, he is going to Dynamax. Oh, a Gigantamax Charizard. I don't have to worry about Sunny Day then. Okay, he's looking to speed up.
Okay, well... I do have Tapu Lele and Kombe left. But I don't want him to... You know what? I'm not even going... I'm not going to chance it. I'm just going to Dynamax Dragonite and do a Max Lightning. And that should take care of Charizard. Unless something happens. Okay, he's going to do Wildfire. Not very effective. And Max Lightning should take care of him. Yep, there we go. Alright, well, that's, well, that was an easy match. Well, that's one victory. Can we get two victories? I have no idea. Okay. Alright, let's continue on with the next battle. Alright, rank 6. That's nice. 10 BP is also nice. So, let's see if we can get into Great Ball tier. How fast can we find an opponent? How fast can we go? Go ahead, it looks like it's going to take a minute. Well, while it is, if you're enjoying the battle so far, don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Smash that like button, it helps with YouTube a lot. And Go ahead and click that notification bell to hopefully receive notifications when I upload. Which I try to upload every day, if not every other day. And comment down below, how is the Battle Stadium treating you this season? Oh, we got a... Oh, we got a Moltres. Galarian Moltres, so... Hmm... A dark type. Pretty sure it's dark type. So dark flying. I uh, got. Uh -huh. hmm. Let's see. Is there anything that Dragonite would like to go up against? Unless it's that fairy type, Mimikyu. This Mimikyu's got skies on, so an extreme speed wouldn't affect Mimikyu. So other than Mimikyu, I don't think there's anything that Dragonite is going to... Well, again, there's the... Okay, let's send out Pheromosa first. Let's do Comfe, because there's nothing... Because the only thing that's a threat is that Ferrothorn. And go ahead and... Well, Blaziken is a big threat to Scizor. Let's go ahead and... Do... To Dragonite. All right. Oh, that's a interesting trainer card with Ball Guy and his soulless stare that just pierces into you. All right. And. I can live with this. Let's see. I'm pretty sure it's going to be a special attack. Let's see. Hmm. Do I want to do lunge or do I want to do. That would be good if it lowers the stack. You know what? I'm just going to go with a high jump kick. Take my chances. Okay, good. It landed. 
and citrus. Yep. Oh, it's gonna yawn me. Oh dear. Oh dear. Either I switch out. I don't want to risk a hit. But. I don't think there's a way that Fairmosa can survive. Alright, let's go ahead and switch out to Compe. That's a safe option. Okay, that's gonna be bad against my Dragonite. Other than that, let's go ahead and do a Calm Mind. Get set up with that. Oh, he's just switching out. Okay, that's gonna give me a free Calm Mind. And he's got Ferrothorn. That's great. That's a big threat, so the only thing that can yeah, can reliably take that out You know, I'm gonna do a big risk. I'm gonna swap into Theramosa and hope that he does a leech seed Because I can live with him doing a leech seed Dang it! Well, that was not good. Okay, well, we're gonna do a dragon dance. And see what I can do with Dragonite. Here's, now he's gonna do a Leech Seed. What I can do is do another Dragon Dance and then Dynamax. But I'm in a very tight spot here. This is not good. This is not good at all. Wow. Well, I got one shot. Might as well do a max form win. That way I can lower Ferrothorn's attack. But, I took a risky play and it did not work out, so that's probably, and because of that, I'm probably going to lose. But I'm going to do the best I can. Smart. Very smart. There you go, that's what I knew wanted to be. Minus attack. Yeah, well, Ferrothorn's set up good. I've got Confei, which is just not that good against Ferrothorn. I might as well get set up with the Calm Mind. Let's 
See, I was hoping he was going to do Leech Seed against Sparamosa, that way I could do High Jump Kick, but it didn't work that way, so... Made a bad call, and I'm probably going to lose because of it. Ooh, Kompe. Alright, raise my defense. He'll probably Leech Seed me. Synthesis. Okay, well, let's play it safe. Yep, that's what I thought he was going to do. What I can do is now call mind again. Now, let's see, if I calm mind again, then I can do... This is just not a very favorable matchup. Okay. Keep doing synthesis and calm mind until I can find an opening to do a Giga Drain. Or, let's see, if they're both not very effective. I could probably get away with the calm mind. Let's see, if they're both not very effective, and I get a stab on this, which makes that 75. Okay, let's risk Calm Mind and then a synthesis and then start draining kissing him. Okay, I think that leads you to take care of me. Yep, it did. Well, that's another loss. I made a bad call and it cost me the game. So, you live and learn. That's the whole. That's the whole point. Living and learning. Let's, oh nope, didn't want to do that. All right, let's just go straight into the next one. Okay. Can we find an opponent relatively fast? Not yet. Still looking. Still searching. Okay. Okay, there we go. We got one. Raven. Wrong thing. Okay, got Salamance, another Ferrothorn. Okay, let's lead Gardevoir this time with Theramosa. And. I need Theramosa for both the Metagross and the Ferrothorn. And Tapu Lele would be good against most of that, so let's do this. He's got a lot of heavy hitters on his team. But we'll see what we can do. Not a very interesting training car. Uh, trader. Uh, 
trainer card. So, what's he gonna lead with? But I do like this character design. He's gonna lead with Ferrothorn. Alright. I would have preferred. It would have been good if I had led Ferramosa, but nothing I can do about that. I know I am very much faster than him, so I'm going to set up a future site and he's probably going to gyroball me unless he wants to set up a... nope, he's going straight for gyroball and if he gyroballs me again that would be nice. Oh, I think he knew. Alright, well, that's fine. Let's see. Well, I guess I can do a focus blast. Hope it hits. But you did. That's nice. That's very nice. And I got special defense drop, which is nice. Yeah, after he saw that Disney Ball, he's not going to risk hitting me with it. And that is how you do it. Oh, and it was critically hit too. Oh, nice. Of course, uh, he knows I got Destiny Bombs, there is no way that he is going to risk setting that off, so I'm going to do another future side, but he should be faster than me, yep, and he's changing to a Steel type, okay, it's Libero, I can plan around that. Send out Pheromosa. Because even if he does Sucker Punch, he turns into a Dark type, which is still weak to fighting. So, let's do a high jump kick. Oh! That is actually really smart. And I've got Tapu Lele. But now they switched out, he should be back to fighting, so let's throw out a Protect. Because he's going to be a special attacker, so. You know what? That actually helps. Him Dynamaxing Gengar helps me tremendously. Oh, it's a Gigantamax, too. Because now he can't Gigantamax Cinder. Uh, uh, Dynamax Cinderace. So that's good. And if I set a Psychic Terrain with Psychic Surge, he can't hit me with Sucker Punch. Not that he would. Okay, well, let's see, Gengar is a dang good special attacker, so I'm not sure how this is going to play out. Even if I take care of Gengar, the question is, how much, what's going to happen with Cinderace? Uh, I might have lost this one. But that was a dang good play on his part, switching out into Gengar. Okay. I survived that. 
Okay, that doesn't really matter with the no longer escape. And a one shot on the Gengar, that's nice. So now I guess it all comes down to if I can survive an attack from Cinderace. So if I see if Cinderace has got if Cinderace has if Cinderace has a focus sash, I lost either way. That depends on can I survive this? Nope. Unfortunately, no. Ah, well, I got a hint to my opponent. That was a dang good play with the Gengar switch. So kudos to you. But I think that'll put us back. I think that'll drop us into rank five, and we gotta work our way back up to rank six. So I'm gonna leave it there for this part. So I will see you again with more ranked battles coming up.